y'all this is Tony from Creative Chica Halls and Crafts and today I have ATC MDC open collab and this collab is open to anybody who would like to participate just make sure that you use the hashtag ATC MDC open collab and also include Life with Patty and Bonnie Bonnie's Corners names in there their channel names because they are the ones who are hosting this okay so I've been working almost every day <laughs> I don't know. I've finally got most of these done. I'll probably do some more because, you know, I have, you know, more Thursdays, hopefully. So, anyway, so uh, what I did was, okay, I made a candy apple. It's a caramel apple, okay, out of the apples from the Dollar Tree, uh, the little uh, fall decor wooden pieces. And then on this one, I just added um, a bow. I don't know. It's light pink, but, hey, it goes. <laughs> To me, it goes, it's pretty. You know, like some of those candy apples that you see at uh, Walmart sometimes, and they're really big apples, and they have like a bow on them? That's what made me decide to do this for some reason. And uh, for some reason, I had this little, um, it's like a little sequin type thing. I just glued it on her because it was green, and it's covering up the hole. <laughs> so anyway, so I used some fall paper, and... Um, and so I just made a candy apple out of it. Now, I do plan to make uh, more candy apples. I do have a metal die to make candy apples with, so I want to try that real soon. So anyway, so I was figuring, like, what can I put on this candy apple? And so I had bought these little trucks. I never know what to do with them, but I buy them anyway. I only bought two sets this year. I bought um, a red one, and then I bought the dark green one, okay? Okay. So I really wasn't sure, you know, sometimes I would put them on tassels and stuff like that, but I decided just to hang them onto the candy apple. Then that way, whoever gets this, they can always use this for something else, you know, and they can just take it right off the stick. So anyway, I embellished it with um, this diamond wrap that I bought a long time ago at Dollar Tree, I think. It's like a really light green. You can't tell because the light in here isn't that great. So this is what it looks like on the back, and I think it turned out adorable. Oh, I also Mod Podge this. I put glitter down here. I put, uh, it's like a gold glitter down here. First I painted it, then I put the glitter, and then um, I painted this green up here first, actually, and then this down here. And then I put glitter, and then I put Mod Podge on it. So, yeah, it's really cute. So I made that, and then uh, I made this one here with the little truck from Hobby Lobby, and I just put some embellishments down here. This little leaf came in a packet. I don't know how many. Um, I showed it on one of my haul videos, but it's really cute leaves, and it's perfect, perfect for the ATCs and MDC cards. So anyway, I think that turned out really cute. It says thanks. I found a booklet. I always have problems finding sentiments. And so I found this like in a book, um, I bought it a long time ago at Hobby Lobby. It has different, you know, seasons in it. So I used that on there. Okay, so this one here, I used the pumpkin from uh, Hobby, uh, not Hobby Lobby, from Dollar Tree. I see like, I don't know, it's like glue or something. I don't know what's going on. It looks like glue, but anyway, you know how you get those glue strings? <laughs> Anyway, so I covered this up with some of these little halfback pearls that I had, and I think it was really cute. I made this pinch bow, which I learned this from Giselle at It's, cra it's Paper and Glue. You all always get her channel mixed up. It's Paper and Glue, you all. She, um, I watched her videos on how to make this. In fact, after I get done here, I'm going to go take a look at another look because I'm making more bows, and I've got to get all the measurements right. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, so I just covered this with the little pearls, and um, then I put these little, um, like, yellow halfbacks down there. So I did that one. And then I also um, colored this, like, a little bit of brown with some black up there to make it look real. And it's the same paper on the back, too, so. And then this one here, uh, I bought these cute little pumpkins from Hobby Lobby way before the season, way before. I think it was only like the fall was only 40%, but I told my husband, I said, I have to have those pumpkins. They're so cute. So I put it on this paper here, and on the back, it's got the yummy pumpkin pie and turkey and uh, apple crisp, cranberries and all that on the back, that paper. But anyway, I thought these was cute, and I just made it simple. I didn't put any words on it or anything like that. I am going to be looking for some sentiments, um, though, 
for Halloween and for Thanksgiving. I do have sentiments in there from Tim Holtz. I've got two books of them, but there's nothing related to the holiday season. So anyway, I'm going to look for that. I don't know if um, Amazon has anything like that. I don't know. So anyway, guys, so that is all of my ATC MDCs for today, and I appreciate everybody for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you later.